just wanted to give you a review real quick on the MR45, which is the field piece recovery machine that they, that they came out with. Um, this particular machine is amazing. Um, we did a sample uh, poll on it and we compared it to what they said in the actual notes. And the notes say that it's able to do about 10 pounds of liquid, whether you're doing push pull or just pulling straight liquid about 10 pounds per minute, which I think is just utterly amazing. Uh, if you're doing vapor pulling, uh, this obviously is gonna slow down a little bit, go down to about a half a pound per minute. But as we all know, when recovering vapor, it's just extremely slow. So that's why a lot of people do you know, prefer the push pull method. But I just wanna do a quick review on this machine. see there's a display on there um i'll leave some pictures up there in the video um it's actually showing the the inlet and the outlet pressure which is pretty cool um this way you don't technically have to use any gauges um to you know see what you're what you're pulling on you just have to calibrate it when you first uh, turn it on um this recovery machine does have a full-on um, pump out mode that you can utilize as well so you have recovery, self-purge, and closed. As you can see right here, there's the knob around the top. They do give you extra gaskets uh, behind the inlet here. There is a screen that they have in there and that gasket, that O-ring that's actually there, the intent is to be able to replace that in case, you know, God forbid that you have an issue with it, um, it's not sealing anymore, whatever have you. Um, always make sure that you're using some sort of filtering uh, when you're taking that liquid or vapor from wherever you're pulling from. The reason why we do that is to ensure that, you know, we really don't want to put any junk in the machine, right? We want it to have as clean of a refrigerant as possible. So my recommendation is buy a small, uh, you could buy a Sporlin uh, 50, 53, no, 52, 52 uh, filter dryer. Just make sure it's the HH. That way, if there's any kind of high acid um, or moisture, you're pulling that out before you're actually going through the recovery machine. Um, it's just highly recommended to, to do so. Um, like I said, you know, we, uh, you can split the units around. Uh, you don't necessarily have to, you know, have it in, in standard. If I do press it, um, uh, we can measure it in KPA, uh, MPA bar and like i said psig so i recommend highly recommend this vacuum pump I, I just think it's utterly amazing um thanks for listening and we'll see you next time